Good morning, Calvary. Hope that you're having a great morning, great afternoon, great evening. Whenever you're watching this, hope your day's going great. You know, I heard a quote a long time ago that said, show me your friends and I'll show you your future. I'm not sure who originally uh, created this quote because I've heard it quoted from so many different people, but the saying has proved to be true, at least in my observation of life. The people that we surround ourselves with have a direct influence on the direction that our life goes in one or multiple areas. It may be that they affect the moods, your attitudes, how you see life. It might be they affect your finances or the course of your career. And I believe it also affects our spiritual walk and the direction that we're heading as we seek to follow and honor Jesus. See, Romans 16, 17 tells us this. It says, I appeal to you, brothers, to watch out for those who cause divisions and create obstacles contrary to the doctrine that you've been taught. It says, avoid them. See, the truth that we're hearing from Romans here is that, that if we want to be people who follow and pursue Jesus, then, then we have to be aware of the fact that there will be people who seek to be a bad influence in our life. They will seek to create divisions and splits and conflict around us. They will be people who create obstacles to us following the teaching of Jesus in our everyday life. Some will do this on purpose, but many will do it unintentionally. But we have the responsibility to evaluate the influence of those around us and to make sure that we're not being pulled away from the life that God has for us because of the influence of people around us. As well, we have an even greater responsibility to make sure that in our relationships, we are the people who seek peace, not division. That we seek to, to tear down obstacles to people who want to follow and serve Jesus, not add obstacles to them following the teachings of Christ. So today, let me ask you, who are your friends? Are they helping you or are they hurting you in your efforts at getting closer to Jesus? Because there will be people who surround us that want to pull us away. So it's our choice to evaluate and to surround ourselves with people who want to draw us closer to Jesus and help us live the life that he's laid out for us. Hope that you have a great and discerning day, Calvary. We'll see you next time.